when I elevate you. Yeah. Higher than you've ever been. So like when you make that other shit for medicine. On a mental and physical tip. You be my highness. Reciprocate. Cause everything you give to me is priceless. No other one before you when I put that on my life. See, you know your girl is trade up the word of be your wife. Yeah. Hey y'all, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. It's your remote Rihanna, and today I'm gonna be talking about how to balance YouTube and school or whatever it is you're doing other than just YouTube. Whether that is work, school, school at work, I'm a student myself, I am in my first year of college, and I've been doing YouTube. Well, I've been trying to do YouTube since 2019, so I have some experience to speak from. First of all, school should be your number one priority. Yeah, education is very important. As I said, I'm in college, so I'm gonna have to pay back the money that I use for school. Therefore, ain't no time to be joking, ain't no time to be playing around. Everything is very, very much serious. Due to the fact that YouTube is a source of my happiness, I can't not do YouTube. It does not make me feel well. I remembered my last year of high school. I had two classes that were really a lot of work was constantly being given out and I couldn't do I couldn't focus on my YouTube as my number one priority and it really 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 stressed me out because school is important I had to do school work first but not doing YouTube makes me very very sad therefore you have to work extra hard so you can do both that's what I had to do yeah, I had to work extra extra hard so I could do both if you're doing online school I'm doing online school, which means I have a lot more free time, which means you have less of an excuse when you have online school because you're spending a lot of time at home. You can use even your lunch break to do some work. That's what I do sometimes. So online school is less of an excuse. You have a lot more free time. It's not like when you're going to school, you have to factor in travel time, all that stuff. You can't really film a lot at school unless you're doing school related videos. Which is killing two birds with one stone but yeah online school makes it more convenient to use your free time because you have a lot more of it to create content my personal schedule for school right now for my fall term i only have four days of class when we get tests we have a week to do the test so a lot of time to get work done but that does not give you an excuse to let it fall to the last minute um I have a class that all my assignments are due Friday. They open on Wednesday and they're due by Friday. So they're very lenient with the amount of time that they give you to do your work. Obviously, if you hand in late, you're going to get marks deducted, all that stuff. But they give you a wide gap of time to complete your assignments. So my first main thing that has been helping me is this bad boy. Invest in a planner. Whether it's a weekly planner, monthly planner, I prefer a weekly planner. This is an undated weekly planner and I kid you not, this has been the most helpful thing since I started to actually use it. It's been the most helpful thing. I didn't really use that at first. Now that I have school, I'm like, you know what? I really need to start using this more. So I have been using it. Um, and basically I could just plan out my week. I have a list of videos that I could film for the week that I have written down, I could star which days I want to designate to filming, write all my quizzes, make sure everything is up to date. I um, usually start planning my next week from the Sunday because it is Monday to Sunday on this planner. So yeah, I have a list of videos that I could film this week. Talking about, you know, easy things I could just get up and do quick, fast, and in a hurry. This video is actually on this list because I already started to plan it. We're going to get into the planning and all that stuff later. You can also check out my video on how to be consistent. That also helps a lot. Invest in a planner. Lifesaver. And all the videos that I do get to create. It feels so satisfying when you just get to mark them off. Fantastic. So plan videos in advance. Whether you need to write a script, organize outfits, if you're doing a lookbook, please plan everything in advance. I usually make a notes on my whatever device I want to make the notes on. Since I have an Apple device, 
I can use my notes all over my different Apple devices. So whatever I'm working on, I go with switch and work on YouTube. Um, when I'm doing lookbooks, I plan like a week in advance what outfits I, I already assemble the outfits and everything, have them ready to go so that filming is much easier. Planning everything ahead of time just makes it easier so that you can film and it really takes a lot of weight off your shoulders. Like if you wait till last minute to start filming something and then you're stressing, that don't really work. You can't really work in bulk when you're stressing, which is the next thing that we're going to talk about. Organize your stuff write your script all that like a week before you plan on filming that way like let's say you want to film on a certain day make sure you plan out everything that you need to do the day before that certain day so that that on that day you just kill out all the content that you need to do quick fast in a hurry and life would be a breeze work in bulk i mentioned this in my how to be consistent video because it really 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 helps use your free time effectively aim for at least two videos when you're filming you already look presentable you might as well go ahead and film more than one video if you have the time if you have the energy do it and bulk filming also allows you to clear out your schedule so that you can focus more on school I think last week i had knocked out four videos so i didn't have to post anything for the end of september because i had all four videos that I needed because I post twice a week so I had all four videos ready to go less stressful a lot more time for me to focus on school working in bulk lifesaver and for those who don't really like editing I mean I don't not like editing but I know that editing can take a very 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 long time to achieve um I recommend also editing in bulk when I film a video, I'm usually eager to edit it. I want to get everything out of the way. This is the only thing that I will not procrastinate with is my YouTube. I like everything done. Everything else in my life, all over the place. But my YouTube has to be organized. Sorry. Let's say you want to let a time out for content creating. Choose one day, you film, you edit. You don't have to worry for the rest of the week. Depending on how much you upload, depending on how much content you created, you could be settled for a while. It gives you time to work on your schoolwork. And I recommend doing your assignments as soon as they're given to you. Well, you don't have to rush, rush them, but do not wait till last minute. I don't know why I'm giving this advice because I usually wait till last minute, but I'm getting better at that and I'm not waiting till last minute. My final thought is, honestly, school is more important and I'm pretty sure your subscribers will understand that you have to take a break if you have to take a break because, you know, school is important. Your education is important. That should not come last. I love YouTube, so I don't want to do anything that will make me have to take a break, which makes, which drives me to work even harder because, like, YouTube makes me happy. I want to create content. If I'm not creating content, I'm sad. And if I'm sad, I'm not going to want to do it. I'm not going to want to do my schoolwork if I'm sad. So if you just knock out all of them, everything's breathe. You don't have to worry. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope this gave you a little information on how to balance school and YouTube or and YouTube and work or school, YouTube and work. Depending on how your cycle is, how heavy your schedule is, I'm pretty sure you can get it done. I have faith in you. I have faith in myself, so I have faith in myself, and I can pull it off, you can pull it off, I'm not saying, that, you know, like, yeah, check out all of my content creator, YouTuber content, I will leave the playlist down below, and it'll probably swing past if it hasn't already, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.